What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of New Parents in Training. So, multiple episodes ago, we did a uh, product review on a high ion uh, soap pump. So that one was really, really good. So we decided to let's try out some other foam or soap pump in the market. One of which we came across is a Simple Human. Now we do have one product from Simple Human, a trash can. <laughs> it's overpriced, I would say, but it's pretty good. It doesn't rust or anything. It still functions as uh, when it first came out of the box. They really have good quality product. So we decided to get two. One is a sensor pump. The other one is a foam sensor pump. So the difference is that one, it gives you foam, obviously. The other one, you can actually put hand sanitizer in. Both of them use sensors, so you don't have to touch to get the soap or sanitizer out. So this will come in handy because the COVID is still out there, right? So we want to uh, be able to wash our hands or sanitize our hands without touching anything when we get home. Today, I'm going to unbox and then test them to see how well they function compared to the high Eon. And I'll put all the product information down in the description below so you can go check it out. So the first box I'm gonna unbox is the sensor pump. This one is the stainless steel. Anyway, let's open it up to see what's inside first. All right, so here we go. We have some warranty card, some for sure. Okay, this kind of teach you how to use it. So they included one bag of liquid hand soap here. I think we can use our own, but they do have their own line of soaps. Register your pump and you get special offers. All right, so we have a charging cable. All right, so here is the pump. Oh, that's it, it's very simple. Simple human, very simple, yeah. <laughs> Here. here is the pump itself um yeah the design is very simple oh you can actually see through to see how much well kind of to see how much uh soap is left and i like the design so it has a really nice finish um it's very sleek okay so the next one obviously is the foam one let's see all right, same deal. They have a bunch of cars. You can just go check it out. Yeah. And don't forget to register your product to get some free special offer. Let's see, a charging cable. All right. So the one we got is called Rose Gold. Uh, they also provide you with uh, one free bag, phone hand soap. This one is Mandarin Orange. It actually looks much nicer than the picture they provided. All right, so here are the two sensor pump and let me go charge them up and test them all right so both pumps have been charged and ready to go so the first thing i want to test out is the sensor pump this is the liquid hand soap type just fyi both these pumps use the same charging cable so you can use the same cable uh, on either one of this so let's see this one has a power button on the back and the way that you pour the liquid is to open up the top. The top is you just pull and then it will open it up. And let's see. The pouch have a line to tell you where to cut. Ooh, bubble. The whole pouch is in. Okay, so let's turn this on. All you have to do is just press once and the blue light should come up. And well, one well, of the good thing about this is it's variable pump. So if, you're, if you put your hand onto the top, it's supposed to pump out a little bit. And if you want more, you lower your hand uh, to this point. So let's try. So initially it might take a few pump before we can actually get the liquid into the pipe. Nope. All right, so it's not much on the top portion. Oh, that's lavender. It smells pretty nice. Let's try 
Okay? So the lower portion is, it gives you three times the amount as the top portion. So the top part, it drops once, and then the lower portion drops three times. So that's a good indicator. So the next one is the foam sensor pump. So this one, uh, the way that you pump it is a little bit different. They have a little button here. Now you press it to release the container underneath. And then you turn this. They have three type of straws. So the blue one is for thinner foam. And the green one is for thicker foam. Now I think the white one is just in between. Uh, but either way, let me test the blue one since the blue one is already on there. Now they do provide you with uh, one pouch and this one is Mandarin Orange. Alright, so let's cut this up. Oh, it smells a lot better than the lavender. Alright, make sure you align the containers. You will hear a click sound if you put it in correctly. Now, to turn it on, you press the button and a LED light will turn green. Now, if it's low on battery, it will flash in red. So, that's how you would know. Anyway, so let's see. And the same as the other one, I think it takes a few pumps before you can actually get uh, the liquid out the first time. So. Oh, so this is the top one pump. And so the same as the other one, the lower portion it will be three pumps. Okay. All right, so final thought, the liquid hand soap pump. This one, I think, is very useful. Not only you can put liquid hand soap in there, but also hand sanitizer in there as well. So this can be very versatile. As far as for this particular one, the foam sensor pump, uh, this one, a little bit too sensitive. I didn't show you the portion where uh, they just keep coming out when I try to stop it. <laughs> so yeah, uh, it, it's just too sensitive for, for us to use. We have a review in another foam soap uh, pump previously. It's made by Hein Eon, and that one is cheaper and also less sensitive. I mean, it works really well, but this one, it just go crazy every time we put our hands even semi near there. Uh, but this one, the hand sanitizer one, this one is, is really good. Uh, yeah, I think the amount that comes out is just perfect for us to kind of wipe our hands wherever we come home. So anyway, if you have any questions, comment down below. Until next time, bye. Okay, so this is the top one. Ooh.